Hello everybody and welcome back to Farm Simulator 15 with me, the Grey Gamer. And we got a little something something here. It's called the Burks. And it's a beast. I'm going to show you what exactly this does. Uh, got it on a link on my other video. And uh, I really like this thing. Uh, you unfold it. Oh, here, let's, I'll show it folded up like that, and then just fold it down like that. You can pick what color you want when you buy it. It's a mod. I'll put the link in the description. Sorry, I got a head cold, guys. I'll try to record this. Uh, anyway, then you unfold it. Now, I don't know that this thing would work in real life, because that's just way too dangerous. See what I'm saying? <laughs> but, it does come in handy for certain things on the farm. Now, like I said, you can pick what color you want. I went with green, so that it would match my uh, tipper here. Now you notice that uh, it makes the sound of stuff going in and uh, there's wood chips in the tipper but it doesn't animate coming out of the uh, of the top there but that's okay you know why because you just vacuumed it up Let's see if I can get in and get that little piece right in front of me there. Yes, beautiful. Now, uh, I tested this on my other map, on my other save game, and uh, I was amazed. Uh, again, I don't think you would use this in a real life situation because the idea that you could just... Uh, yeah, it won't work on that. Uh, but I don't know that you could, like I said, use this in a real life situation. Maybe you could, you know, but you'd have to be really careful and really kind of crazy, <laughs> in my opinion. But as far as cleaning up the farm, and getting stuff taken care of. Oh my. Can't think of anything better. And uh, I, I uh, wanted to try something for kicks and giggles. So again, on my other map, I tried this. I know that's a cut piece right there, see? See that little wedges? I know that's a cut piece. And I've got this as low as it'll go, so it won't it won't get that one. But watch what happens. All right, now you see that my uh, wood chipper is 100% full. So I just took out that one tree. So it, that that and we'll take this down sell it and uh, get rid of those other trees we well, might just uh, clear some paths I've got the uh, other equipment that I told you about I've got it down at the uh, uh, selling point down here but I'm thinking I'm going to bring that little cedar back. The little cedars down there, the little tippers down there, and the old cultivators down there. But I think I'm going to bring that little cedar back and use it to uh, plant, replant the grass along the fields because uh, it'll work work better uh, doing that. So there we go wood chips like easy breezy so uh, 
I like the idea that uh, you can just vacuum it up. Plus, I want to get certain trees off the property, and we want to start putting uh, certain trees back on the property. Hold on a second. I realize I don't have my sound system fixed the way I normally do. Hold on. Just give me a minute. There we go. I hope that fixed the sound problems. I uh, forgot to turn my speakers down and put my headphones on. That's kind of a messed up situation, but uh, again, uh, this is pretty good. Uh, like I say, if you can take out those whole trees and stuff, yeah, I'm okay with that. You know, because we want to do, uh, like I said, I want to get into more of tree management, meaning certain areas on the farm, the trees are just in the way. And then, and then there's certain types of trees that work in certain areas, like these birches and stuff right here. They work right in, right there because they're not going to be in the way for nothing and, and things. But but uh, as far as clearing clearing uh, clearing area, you know, we want to take care of some stuff. Now I'm going to try it a little bit different this time. I'm going to come in at the leaves on this one and see what happens. Okay. I think we got to get, see, we got to get, I think you have to be lined up on some solid, uh, oh, you know what? I didn't turn it on. Let's turn it back on first. Can I not unfold it? It's on. Okay. So that doesn't work. So let's see if we can get around to this stump. Okay, we got that piece. Let's see if I can maneuver this tree back out and I might be able to maneuver into position on it if I come if I come at it directly let's see what happens there we go so as long as you hit it appears to be as long as you hit it right from the uh, stump part or the main trunk part, if you will, uh, you can clear you can clear out uh, quite a bit, eh? Oh wow, that, that just sounded Canadian just there. Okay, so we need to clear. Actually, need to clear this tree line here. Let me go ahead and jump out chainsaw. We need to clear these trees here because they're going to be right in the way of the uh, harvester. And uh, we don't want that. There we go. Get as low as we can. Come on, give me a spot. quite how I wanted to fall but okay so now we'll get in here now I don't know if this is going to work here because uh, for one thing I got the uh, I got it uh, too close to the stump but I'm also pretty full on my 
tipper. Yeah, 85% in, so I'm thinking it'll take it, but it won't give me credit for all of that. It'll just fill up, is what I'm thinking. Yep. But again, if we have to uh, clear the tree line, it's definitely the way to go. So yeah, pretty cool. And we do have the uh, canola growing on the field. We did uh, we did uh, fertilize it and uh, and that. So uh, yeah, pretty good. I think it was Jimmy Olson. I hope I'm not getting that wrong. I didn't write it down, but uh, it sent me the link to this, and uh, I appreciate it. Uh, like I said, I don't know if you'd use this in real life. I haven't seen one. Uh, I haven't read a look for one either. But uh, as far as the game, as you can see, it makes it a lot easier and simpler. At least, especially for somebody like me, and uh, who's all about, like I said, about tree management. I'm all for uh, for having trees around on the property, but uh, they got to be what, where, where you want them and how you want them, and they have to be what you want them to be. Because I'm planning on uh, planting some more. Uh, Firs or, or poplars, definitely along the, the field lines. I've already got the planter ready to go. And uh, like I said we have to clear off those side roads, side rows for the uh, harvester. Plus, we could make the money because we're going to need to buy a harvester. another harvester so yeah this makes quick work of it could use a bigger tipper I see that um, I'll have to take a look at that maybe we'll look into a bigger tipper I don't know seeing that it only takes one tree or, or two to fill it up but still that's pretty sweet Pretty sweet operation. Excuse me, there I had to cough a little bit, and uh, I'm the last one in the house to catch a head cold. So uh, I apologize for my voice being all messed up. But uh, we're going to keep this short today. Um, we're going to take care of this tree here, and then. Uh, probably go down and cut these other trees that are near the road or near the field and uh, then we'll call it an episode but uh, again this is really sweet A sweet little deal man let's see Cut it off and jump into the handy dandy. Unfold the bad boy. Lower it down and release. Release the beast. So usually, what I can do is just push it out of the way a little bit. And then come at it from my other angle here. Oh, did I turn it on? Would it help if I turned it on? There we go. And we're up to 58%. Very nice. 
Very nice indeed. Now I have to make a decision here. Kind of an executive decision. I know that birch needs to go, but do these other two trees back behind here need to go? Like this, do these three here need to go? I'm thinking that one's probably okay. This one probably needs to go. So does that one. This one definitely needs to go. Definitely needs to go. So, cut that off. And, uh, drop that bad boy like a bad habit. And, uh, do the same thing with these ones. Now, uh, Come on. I want to verify that uh, I got these, but uh, by verifying, I mean I want to make sure that they're out of the way. Of the, uh, for the harvester. Okay, so three, three trees down. Let's see, that's how far is that from the field right there? Yeah, those two I think can stay. I think so. We'll have to test it because we're going to get different. Uh, we're also going to get different uh, doohickeys. Okay, turn it back on. Scoop it up. Uh oh. I went over the top of it. <laughs> Alright, let me get a different angle on it, maybe coming from downhill or uphill on it to the downhill position would be the way to go here let's see yep there we go so we took care of the birch now let's see if we can get this one there we go we're a hundred percent and two of the trees are down all we got is stumps Whoops, that tree there's got to go. Let me cut it while I'm thinking about it. Because uh, if I... Uh, then we got to do the same thing on the other side. So it's just a tree cutting party. Do that. Let's lift that. Let's fold that. And, uh, like I said, I don't know if we do this in real life or not, but we might as well make it look like uh, we would. <laughs> but I want to come back and plant some more trees in along this row, grass and stuff. And uh, this will help do it. Plus, we can sell the other equipment. A lot of the other equipment, actually. The other uh, tractor with the uh, bow. Oh, we're getting stuck on me. Come on now. Uh, the other tractor with the grabber, uh, I could get rid of that. The uh, crusher, I could get rid of that. Uh, yeah. This takes care of a lot of good stuff. A lot of stuff. I'm going to finish dumping this off at the bio 
here. Biomass plant. And again, like I said, we're making some money. We need to get another harvester. Uh, so we're going to have to see how that works out because we might need more space along the fields for the, the bigger, bigger harvester to make the terms. But again, uh, we'll figure it out and go from there. Alright, I'm going to leave here and go over across the street real quick. And uh, go in here. here. Didn't give myself enough room, did I? Across here. There we go. Up here. Through the trees. Okay. So I think what we're going to do is we'll end the episode here, but what I'm going to do is I was going to sell all three of these implements, but now that I'm thinking about it, I'm going to grab the, uh, let's see if I can grab that cedar out of there. And if I try to sell them, I don't know what order they're going to try to sell them to me in, so let's see if I can hook up. Come on, go forward. Now go back. Come on. Oh, oh, I had it. I had it. I had it. It's right there. So let's take this out of here. Do not get stuck. Are you kidding me? Put the, I put the cedar down so that the weight is uh, harder on the uh, back because I noticed that the cedar up uh, it tends to take the uh, front wheels off the ground. You notice how now my front wheels are barely on the ground. They have barely, barely, barely any traction, and I'm um, wheeling it. We popping wheelies here as we go. So uh, yeah, go ahead and sell these implements, and uh, we'll call it an episode. Again, I wish my uh, voice was better. But uh, it'll just take time to get through. I, like I said, I'm the last one in the house to get the head cold. So I'm thinking, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, 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 uh Those are the pieces. Those are the pieces of wood that I left in the, the uh, tipper. <laughs> All right, well, guess what? We're going to try something. I don't know if it will work, but we're going to try it. Let's unfold that pipe out. I'm going to leave the, I'm not going to lower the, you know, lower it down like that. I'm going to leave it up. I don't know if it will work. Uh, let's see here. If it will start. Yeah, it started. Let's see if we can... There we go. Now we can lower it down. And see if we can... Oh, this is sweet. You know what's nice about this? We, uh, not, not only did we clean up the, uh, the uh, mess that was here at the cell point, but we got 9% wood chips off of uh, pieces that I wasn't going to even uh, mess with. So there you go. It's definitely worth its 
wait. I will give you the description. Uh, oh, did I do it again? Did I come right over here? That's it. We're going cross country. Um, I think I still got it running up front there, so I'm really scared of the drivers coming past me. But uh, yeah, there you go. Well, I'm the Great Gamer, and uh, I do appreciate you stopping by and checking me out. As always, feel free to uh, leave your comments and suggestions below. And uh, some of you are probably looking at this saying this is very kind of cheaty. To use the uh, phrase of my friend Stocko Gloss, it's kind of cheaty. Yeah, it is. But, I don't know, it's a mod. It's goes in the game and uh, whoever took the time to make it uh, did a, what I consider an excellent job on it and uh, if it helps me get these uh, fields cleared uh, I'm okay with that too I will catch you guys tomorrow for now.